Hello people of earth and welcome to my latest video. I don't know if this video will be latest when you are watching but uh, now this is the latest video and welcome to my latest video. So in this video I will compare OBS and Shadowplay side by side for streaming purposes if you are a beginner. So without wasting any more time let's get started. Now if you are a beginner and you want to stream so which application you should prefer obs or nvidia shadow play in this video we are gonna look at this thing okay now first let's see the ui first let's see the ui of obs now if you open the OBS for first time then you will see a dark screen here what the fuck why it's dark and why there is no audio coming why this is not moving what the fuck and what is this option okay start streaming okay start recording okay that's okay studio mode what the fuck is this setting okay let's check out the setting whoa that's too many option if i'm a beginner then I, I should be overwhelmed with this lot of option hell lot of option so this is the ui of obs now let's see the uh, ui of nvidia shadow play oh i have to press just alt and x a shortcut key to open this menu and I want to stream then what should I do I just go click on this and just start it that's it just start it now second point uh, how to set up stream for OBS now to set up my stream uh, what I have to do uh, setting okay stream so first I need to select the service then I have to find the server then I have to find the stream key and then I can start streaming at YouTube wow that's uh, that seems a lot of work uh, okay now let's look at the nvidia menu what i have to do to start streaming at youtube okay, i opened the menu i i just started it wow it automatically picked my channel i just have to add title and go live that's it yeah that's it ah that was easy Now first, if you want to start the stream at OBS, you first have to open the OBS, app, of course. Okay, just open it. Now you have to click on start stream and you have to minimize it. You can't close it, so it will be running in background. You can see right here. now let's see how you start stream in nvidia uh, nvidia shadow play so for obs you have to minimize your game and you have to start obs and start streaming but for nvidia huh, it has a mentos life assume you are playing a game you can't minimize it otherwise it will mess up your resolution or it will take time for again maximizing it so what should you do to start streaming in nvidia life you just press the shortcut key for streaming that's it just press the shortcut key and start streaming that's it that's all you have to do for it now 
Now after making this point, now let's come to the most weighted point, which is the performance comparison between both of them. Who is whose performance is better? Uh, let's check it by uh, comparing side by side both of them in a PUBG gameplay. Uh, so I was streaming PUBG with both uh, with. Uh, so I stream PUBG using NVIDIA and using OBS and I am showing you the results side by side so you can compare uh, both of them then which is more performance efficient and yeah one more thing the uh, resource monitor is also off on so you can see what resources uh, who is consuming and who is more efficient. So take a, uh, take a look at that and I will be ending the video after that video. So if you like the video then hit the like button and i will see you in my next video it 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 was a quick video so you can thank me later so see you guys in the next video